guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a Target, Walmart, and Dollar Tree haul. So if you are interested in seeing what I picked up. Okay, keep so we are gonna start off with Dollar Tree just because I only got two items from there and they are the same exact items. It is the Skin Nutrition Age Defined Dark Circle and Puffiness Serum. And I picked these up because I did look at reviews while I was at the store and they did have some pretty good reviews and these run for like 10 bucks on their website. So why not grab two when they're only a dollar? So the next stuff comes from Walmart and I picked up some more conditioner by Tresemme, the luxurious moisture. And then my daughter needed some more six to nine month pajamas. So I just picked up a couple of these and they're way too cute. And then this next one is my favorite. Ugh. How could you pass And then the rest of this stuff is from Target. And we will just start off with these onesies. I got two three packs of onesies. One has some hearts that says hello with some other scattered hearts. And then this one is just a little pink giraffe and some more giraffes. <laughs> so cute. And then I had to pick up some more Aveeno Baby Lotion, and it is in Soothing Relief Moisture Cream. And my daughter used to use Johnson & Johnson, but then she was starting to break out from it. And I wasn't sure that it was the Johnson & Johnson that was doing it, but my son had, this sim had a similar reaction to it when he was little. So I switched her to this, and almost all of her little rash and eczema patches are gone. And then this was on clearance. I have purchased this before and I did really like it. And it is the Garnier Fructis Texture Tees. Up next is this Garnier Fructis Flat Iron Perfector Straightening Mist. And I straighten my hair probably like three or four times a week. And since I have been using this, I have noticed that my hair has been more healthy, it's been shinier, and I haven't had nearly as much damage as before when I was using the Tresemme kind, so that is a plus. Next is this Secret Deodorant. It's just the Invisible Solid in Hawaii Citrus Breeze. And then we picked up this I Love Nail Art by Sally Hansen. Hansen. It's just like this felt tip pen and you make little designs on your nails. And then I have taken both of these out of the package just because this haul has been collected over a couple of days. And the first thing that I picked up is the Super Sizer Mascara by CoverGirl. This is what the wand looks like. I don't know if you can tell, but the bristles go from small to bigger. And I have just used this probably like two days. And I really like this. The wand like combs through your lashes. The only thing I would say is if you're not into super black dark mascara, this probably isn't for you. Just because when you do put this on, it is pretty jet black. And then the second thing that I picked up was this CoverGirl Bombshell Volume by Lash Blast. And this is a two-part mascara. The first part, which I'm pretty sure is the Lash Blast formula because the wand is pretty similar as well. This looks like that. And then the second wand is just like your traditional spoolie. So I looked up reviews for this after I put it on and there were a lot of complaints about how hard it was to take off the mascara. So I was a little worried when I went to try. I just tried using my basic uh, makeup remover wipe and that didn't touch it at all. So I have just some regular Neutrogena eye makeup remover and that barely touched it as well. You do need to use a oil-based eye makeup remover and that is the only way I found that you can get this off. So it definitely has some staying power. And then the next thing that I picked up was this Revlon Age Defying CC Cream in the color 010 Pale. I believe these typically run around like 13 or $14. So when this was on clearance for three bucks, I definitely had to pick this up. I typically don't reach for the BB and CC creams, but for almost $10 off, I definitely have to give this a try. And then, more stuff from the clearance bin just because that is my favorite place to look when I go to Target. I got this Rimmel London Stay Glossy 3D Lip Gloss in the color Lights Camera Action. 
And I took the little price tag off already, but I think it was only like $1.98. Okay, so the find that I was most excited about was these. These are the Essence Extra 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 Large Shine Lip Gloss. And I have never heard of anything by Essence. And I even like looked around Target to see if they had other makeup stuff there and I didn't find anything. So where they keep these, I have no idea. <laughs> but they were in our clearance bin and these were only 74 cents. They say that they're typically $2.49, so they were 70% off. And I figured for 74 cents, I have to try them. And I did get one in every color that they had, which is 26 Twinkle Twinkle, uh, 28 Pretty and Hibiscus, 30 Frosted Pink, 17 Fabulous Fuchsia, and then 29 Cute Pink. So I am really excited to try these. I love lip glosses so much. So hopefully these pan out. And if not, well, they were only 74 cents each. I guess I'll lose like five bucks. Okay, well that is all I had for you guys today. I hope you enjoyed this haul. And if you did, make sure to give it a thumbs up. Be sure to subscribe to my channel and I will talk to all of you lovelies later. Bye.